Welcome to the video, today I'm going to show how I can download the new Microsoft Edge Chromium browser. So in order to do this you want to go ahead and load what the browser you use the most, which is going to be Google Chrome for example, and you want to go ahead and go to the link in the description below. Now it's going to take you to Microsoft web page that looks like this, and there's going to be two versions of Chromium. So there's going to be the dev version which is going to be updated weekly, and the canary version which is updated daily. I personally went for the Canary version because people are saying it's more stable than the dev version so it's completely up to you. Now bear in mind that whenever you're watching this video the Microsoft web browser will be changed dramatically over time because this is way before the beta stages. So when you go ahead and open it up it's going to basically run through a quick setup process and the really good thing about this is that all your bookmarks um, and your cookies and everything will be transferred over from the default browser to the new Chromium one. And I've also found that this browser is actually really, really quick. And this is way before the beta stages, so hopefully it stays this quick. So if I go to some websites here, so if I go to google.co.uk, as you can see, it's near enough instant. If I go to youtube.com, again, it's pretty much instant. I'm going to do another one here. We're going to go to Amazon. And again, it's pretty quick. And this is obviously going to depend on the hardware on your computer. But for my computer, this is quicker than Google Chrome. If you want to change the way the home page looks, all you need to do is click on the three arrows here and you can change your layout. And if you want to add a home button, just click on the three dots in the top right, go to settings and you can go ahead and change everything from here. So if this video is helpful, please leave a like and pass it on to someone who may find it helpful as well. If you do have any questions or comments, just leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. So thank you so much for watching and have a good day.